That was one of the weirdest things Gary ever taught me. Like, Gary's like, don't ever say that name. And I'm like, what? Osiris? Because I was reading my Freemason stuff. And he's like, don't say that name. That name's... And I'm like, wait a minute. Are you talking about the one I just said? He's like, yeah, don't say that. It brings bad energy. I'm like, Gary, what the f***? You sound crazy. And then my, like, I went all pale in the face and I was like, wait a minute. At the deepest part of my documentary, when I was digging, it was all about that name. And that was like the worst things that ever started happening in my life. That was like my rock bottom. It was uh, the damn near psychosis, the most dark voodoo type shit happening. But Gary looked at me and he's like, I bet the worst things happened uh, when you were studying that. When I told him I studied that Egyptian... Uh, God, and uh, yeah, I was really surprised because I'm like, well, wow, Gary, other people have had just as bad. Of, mine was rock bottom, but the people he talked to wasn't rock bottom, but they had really bad experiences. And there's certain vowels that are like, yeah, you're not supposed to uh, say out loud. Like in Egyptian times, 80% of language was like, you didn't say it. It was more like psychically understood. You weren't supposed to, like, change the vibration in the air. Uh, eh. What about Horus? No, Horus was different. Uh, Horus is our, too, right? It's like an anagram. Uh, yeah, the other gods aren't that powerful, but uh, the one with the O is stupid powerful. For When I say gods plural, I'm saying it like it's in the Bible, too. Gods plural means, you know, they're referring to what we see as gods, but it's like demons. Has Poseidon is a better streamer than you? Yeah, anyone who's doing IRL is better than me right now. I should be doing IRL, but, you know, I'm up here. Uh, and my IRLs are going to be different, guys. Like, I think, what? why don't I just do what I'm supposed to do? Like, I'm the only streamer who can actually pick up the waitress and get their number. I do it offline anyway, any restaurant I go to. Why don't I just do my dating stuff with my IRL? So, like, when we go sit down at a restaurant, I feel like I'm too respectful when I go out in public, you know? And then I have my crazy day, but most of the time I'm way too respectful. Have you noticed that? I'm like, oh, there's a camera. I don't want to embarrass her. Yeah, Cuba, they do believe in that. Hold on. Well, there's nothing really to do up here. We have an underground mall that I lose connection in. I used to I used to stream all the time in Canada. I got a couple of buddies I could go out with too. But uh, yeah. Why are you contradicting? You believe in the Bible and witchcraft. Well, to be a Christian, you have to believe in witchcraft. <clears throat> like are you. It? You have to. You have to believe in sorcery. You have to believe in magic. You have to believe that that stuff is real. You can't just say it's, oh, it's hocus pocus. Because then, then people say your miracles are hocus pocus, right? Although miracles are different from witchcraft. Way different. If you're a Christian, witchcraft won't affect you. Yeah, it's like 80% of that shit won't affect you. I wouldn't say it's 100% guaranteed, though. I've seen some crazy deaths that, like, were predicted by uh, the guy casting the, the bad luck. Although a lot of people say... Um, in the conspiracy world, they say the bad luck are certain ley lines. Like, they never built churches on random hills, random hills or, you know, random parts of land. They always pick the right energy center. And then uh, sometimes when these energy centers crisscross, that's, that's, that's where you have the most car crashes. That's what people say. Now, I want to do a more regular stream today. I don't know how long I'll be live, but I want to do a more for my community kind of stream. Not just 
what do we call the new guys? I don't know what to call the new guys. I like them. They say they talk good about me. They protect me. But the new guys are kind of like, I don't know. If someone memes harder than me, I don't like them. I'm like, bro, chill out, bro. I don't need I don't even have a coffee right now. Yeah, George, you're just lying. The anima of the male psyche is so, and it is a collective, it is so hyperinflated in 2023, going on to 24, that I don't believe anyone who says, oh, I can get, I just don't want to. No. No. I don't buy it. Does anyone else buy that? Appreciate that. I don't buy it because COVID sunk us into... When COVID did that first one year sunk, sinking thing, I talked to my team and they're like, yeah, it's time you start selling dating because people are in darkness. And for a year and a half or two, or is it two or three almost? I said, no. But... Do you know how much money the dating guys are going to make in five to ten years? Which That's what Red Pill really is, is dating, which is kind of sad. Red Pill is not really about truth. Hundred gifted? Who? Spam the name in chat like we used to. I don't even see that. I told you when I do more regular streams, we get subs, money. Like we, bro, I could do literally anything and I get subs. I'm the best live streamer without trying. I'm too chaotic when I try. <laughs> only a hundred gifted? Oh, it was only ten. Put this. What's his name? Let's ban him. No, I was Poseidon, action man. Any streamer that wears a dress cannot be a better live streamer than me. That's like saying Dwayne Johnson's the best actor because he wore a tooth fairy dress. Jack Doherty pulled up on Island Boys. Look, I'm not going to lie to you, dude. I don't watch that. <laughs> this is so cruel to say, but I, I hate telling live streamers I don't watch their because they get hurt. <laughs> I don't really. I don't even find it entertaining. I never did. I never even knew what was going on. I never ever. I was just in the house farming clips for my Discord. I never even understood their beef. I just pretended. I was like, oh, he said that. She said this. Yeah. What's your relationship with Jack Doherty? Uh, it's bad, bro. It's like, I mean, it's good for, for him. Because, like, if someone pushes into my little brother zone, I forgive them a lot. You know what I mean? And so, like, I'm not going to lie, dude. Jack Doherty is the easiest human being to work with. Like, if if you gave me um, a reality TV show to run, I think I would make him my co-host or, or my co-manager over a real mic. Cause he'll my kid. What the? F what the f is that? <laughs> yeah, this website, bro. Yeah, yeah. Watch my impression. This is how most streamers act when they get caught view botting. All right, I've never view botted. Okay, check this out. Hey, whoa! What the hell was that? My chat doesn't normally do that. That was weird, right? Right, guys. <laughs> Why does everyone act the same way when they get caught? I've never view bought it. So when you guys bug my like that, hey, I know what you're trying to do. Now nah, I don't smoke Lucky Strikes. I did once, and the, there's one comment you guys kept posting on the Discord saying he's like a World War II hero. <laughs> so it's like a world with Lucky Strikes, and I'm like, dude. Am I seen as a World War II old hero? Am I seen like as an American badass, even though I'm not? Or am I seen as a German Nazi? 
Like, how do you guys see me? <clears throat> I'm kidding. I'm not. Did not. Yo, we're gonna clean this. Up. 2024. No more Nazi jokes. I'll wink at you, but I won't actually do any more of these because. Uh... No, I gained like 800 followers in like a day on uh, Kick or on Twitter, and then two weeks later, I slowly dropped, and it was like some weird. Um... Like, people want to tell me it's uh, bots and stuff, but I don't think it's that. I think it's because I'm in my winter mode. I'm not active, right? Like, we're gaining, like, 900 followers a day when I was uh, IRLing. Well, yeah. Also, the, I went nuts on Twitter. Like, my, I think my shadow band is... I don't know if I, it keeps going on and off, the shadow band, but, bro, I have to clean up so many tweets. I think there's a system. Is there a... Something I can download that deletes all my tweets. Why do you talk so much about uh, girls and picking them up? Because that's what life's really about. Is when you can sell yourself to you can sell yourself to your boss and get a bigger raise. Um, like the anima is huge in the young man today. Like if I talk about getting ninety nine percent of chat do not relate with me. That's how much times have changed. If it was the 1950s in a Christian society, at least half that chat would understand what it's like to have a girlfriend. Or sh but it's so rare to um, have a normal upbringing now. I mean, like if you grew up riding a bicycle without an iPad and had a girlfriend, you are in like, you are in like top 0.0001% of confident people. Like that is, you probably healthy. Alton donated $5. John, why don't you talk about Mother Teresa and her connection to the Jesuit order? Is it because she's Albanian? Because I've already done it. And uh, yeah, there's arguments for her being very well connected with the elites. Um. And there's arguments of her being a really good person. But uh, I just don't think the arguments are that strong. Like, if I went after John Podesta, there's a lot of evidence that he's a Satanist. He eats flesh. But if I go after Mother Teresa, the evidence is kind of like, oh, she hung out within. Like, I'm sorry to say this, bro. The dumbest f debate or excuse me, the dumbest conspiracy arguments is Zerka hung out with a Satanist, therefore he's a Satanist. Look at the industry I'm in. You think I'm not going to sit on a sauce cast with some freak show, especially if I'm Mother Teresa? Like, are you... The dumbest argument is like, oh, Trump sat next to a evil guy, therefore he's evil. I don't like those arguments at all. I hate them, actually. Now, if you if you take a million photos with one dude, that's a way different story. But how many, like Zerka sits next to a transgender, or Zerka has a transgender friend, therefore he supports the transgender ideology. I hate those arguments. Like I don't even get them. I don't get why people. I don't even get how they go viral on Twitter. That's stupid. So, and I don't really believe in that whole you. Uh, guilty by association at all because like what if you're in the entertainment in industry it's not many christians there what about people who hang with epstein the prince andrew one yeah that that's that's fine but if let's say um who's someone we like If Ye took a photo with Epstein, to me it's not that damning evidence that Ye is evil. If he has multiple photos, that's different. If they're best friends, but man, the top is so small. Everyone takes photos together. So, Can you talk about Moonchilds? Specifically, when they traumatize the embryos while to create an MKUltra sleep. 
that that's as type of psychic programming that's actually overrated the real psychic programming happens when let's say five years old even in spartan times egyptian times whenever whatever you want to go they'll give you, they'll give you a puppy to bond with and then at the peak of your love and bond they get the puppy in front of you and so you can't handle the trauma that's happening and so your mind goes into the Elysium or a happy state, la la land. And then you're like this, just drooling in trauma. And that's when they can program you and say, get up. And then that voice is so traumatic that the children, even if they don't actively do what you say, they can be triggered at 30 years old with one phone call, get up, shoot cool but the programming was mastered way earlier through demonic intervention and world war ii had a more scientific approach with its mk ultra but a lot of hollywood stars i'd say 80 percent of the hollywood stars 85 90 percent are they knew who those like for example tom cruise uh the ruling class knew who tom cruise was going to be when he was one years old Okay, a movie star doesn't... <laughs> you guys are so... Did you think they just found a movie star who can fly a jet, helicopter, jump out of buildings? Uh, yeah, that's literally an MK Ultra masterclass uh, spy, really. But he, not a spy to countries, even though he went to Ukraine and did all that. I'm, he's a spy for the ruling class, like... Which is one. And then there'll be like very low level people. Like I think the lowest level um, will be like these guys who are linked through family like Tate. Like you could tell Tate, he gets orders, but he doesn't know where they come from. And bad things happen if he doesn't do what they say. Also, a lot of you guys shouldn't. Feed your girl too much Zerka content. I don't know why you guys think that's a good idea. It's better you behave like Zerka without her knowing who you're emulating. Because when I meet you guys and you're like, wait, stand on this side, Zerka, take a picture with my girlfriend. Why? And I look at you like, why do you want me to hold your girl? Please, Zerka, just do it. No, no, I'm not a c Just do it. Okay, but why? Why are you, <laughs> why are you making it weird for me? I'm teaching the total opposite of what you're doing to me right now i don't like that at all yeah yeah i'm rich dude and i can't believe i used to think i made money on twitch my name youtube bunny gotta get back on that youtube grind here's how you get riches with only a hundred k followers like in the beginning of my year have hot only fans rich girls pay for everything and boom, 2023, you just come back to your home rich as f <laughs> You know what's weird, though? I swear I'm cheaper now that I'm doing better. I don't. I remember spending so much. And now, because in my head, I'm like, yeah, one day i got to save up for a mega church. I think we can find investors for a Zerka mega church. Like, I could be located in uh, maybe Arizona when I retire. When I'm done the entertainment route. Alton donated $5. Donald McGuire was a Jesuit priest who served as Mother Teresa's confessor. He touched over a 1,000 lip. After allegations came out he was removed from the ministry. Teresa wrote to the Jesuits Yuring Gung his reinstatement. You know sometimes you gotta talk. <laughs> I'm kidding. Look I'm not defending none of all Jesuits are f in my opinion. Right. I don't know much about Mother Teresa. I don't even talk about her. I've, when have I even mentioned her? So you, what are you saying? I'm a fan of hers because she's got Albanian blood. I don't, I, don't, I don't really get what you're trying to accuse me of, bro. Uh, but who, who even made it popular that Jesuits are evil? Me. There's no other YouTuber influencer who ever said this. Besides some declassified CIA that you have to go on 
define, but why are you acting like I didn't popularize your opinion? You and it's weird because that's like the biggest disconnect I had is everyone's like, you became a Catholic when you exposed Catholicism for its Jesuit poison. Yeah, that's literally what the Bible says is every everything's going to be corrupted. Like That makes a lot of sense, actually, you know. Red Gray donated ten dollars. Three life paths both on eleventh. What does this mean for me? Double charisma. That's in that you have like the greatest number mix ever. Like your DNA is to be a winner. If I was a three with a second eleven, actually no, I like double five better. Yeah, double five worked because then you know, like usually you need ten million followers to be that magnetic to women and i don't have that and i'm that magnetic wait till i do have it it's gonna be insanity zirka you're not a double five you're a, what do you are you 1994 is a five noah donated five dollars why are people born on february more religious and nobody knows it was a pisces thing Nick. Um, I would say because January is more argumentative, one energy and two kind of like can, it feels like two doesn't see itself as God, even though two is a very rotten number. When you look at the months, it doesn't seem that way. Like look at famous Pisces throughout history. They're pretty sick. They're great people. 90 Towers donated $5. Why is the 25th of December celebrated in different religions for different gods? Uh, that's all hocus pocus. I don't buy into that. Um, the Zeitgeist. Uh, actually, there's many gods who were born of a virgin. No, there wasn't. That's all bull. They just connect history. They cope. They... they they try and say Mithra is like Christ. No, it's not. Look into it. Read books. Don't don't watch Zeitgeist. I used to believe in Zeitgeist documentaries, and it's so stupid. Uh, even the trinities were kind of like very different. Uh, Let's go, pal. I'm making a withdrawal here. Chad is fat note circa donated five dollars. Give your best tips for fast weight loss. Fast weight loss would be oh simple. Uh, fasting so your calories are back loaded into the evening that way you have less insulin spikes throughout the day uh, and less your appetite isn't stimulated because you're in a fasted state better hormone production nutrient partitioning and metabolism because you're fasted and then you want to fill your stomach with fiber and caffeine so you can start with a green apple and a black coffee now it's very very hard for you to have more meals and have protein shakes before each meal. So if you have, I used to do this with bikini girls that I would uh, get ripped for shows. You cannot overeat if you have a protein shake. Like food doesn't taste good. I can bring you a bunch of McDonald's. It doesn't taste good if you had three scoops of protein before your meal. You let it sit 10 minutes in your stomach, your stomach turns to concrete. It's impossible if you're hitting your macronutrients protein intake first it's impossible to overeat and if you do overeat the next day you're not as hungry so net calories of seven days a week because we don't look at it through a 24 cycle we look at it weekly weekly you're less hungry without noticing it so even if you eat the mcdonald's after your protein shakes for some reason you end up leaner at the end of the week and then you add activity instead of cut calories it's always better to increase a biomechanical output then cut calories uh and then keep as many carbs as you can until you're at the weight you want always keep carbs in um and then you can have some digging phases where you slice out carbs if you have like a photo shoot or something but that actually damages performance uh unless you're very fatty so it's just sometimes you can't cut depends who you are 90 towers donated five dollars i know i'm a three life path born october 1st 1990 but confused about the other numbers 
Is your birth year also a separate number? Yeah, your birth year is a separate number. Yeah, there's certain numbers you're binded to that is your energy. And you don't you don't know that your subconscious is noticing your birth year number, but you're not. So mine's 1994, 23 is a five. Okay. Mm -hmm. How to keep your face clean, how to keep your face clean. I don't know. I have pimply oily skin until I fast. So if I fast for like 14 hours, shower, I pressure wash, and then it look, looks Gio like this. donated $5. Jesus' real birthday is 9-11, Hesse Virgo, as said in Revelation 12-1. Oh, I've heard of this. You're going to have to send me a bunch. Send me on Twitter. Uh, post on my comments and say, hey, I'm the 9-11 Jesus guy. And uh, send me everything there and I'll look at it. Look into it. I love stuff like that. Circa, do you ever get over your first love? Or does she always float around? Dude, your first love is nothing like your second. Because first love is not your adult. <laughs> I think you're trying to say second because your first one you're you're a kid when you do it the second one hello, you're hello donated five dollars does adding your life path with the day you're born on energy mean anything adding your life path with the day you're born oh uh, no but there's uh, there's a different trick that uh reveals a lot about you but that's not how you do it <laughs> uh no adding your life path with the day you're born no it has to be what you see so that's my hint to you. It's what you see. So I'm February 23rd. How many numbers can I pull out of that? The two doesn't really matter. The 23 is a five. That's why I'm so dominant in five energy. Noah donated $5. You say words hit your conscious and symbols hit your subconscious. What are symbols you can use for girls to fall for you? Or is this satanic? Well, I don't think it's satanic. I think your intention makes it good or evil. But uh, something you can do is you can wear red. So if if you really want to like speed run the girl, they respond In to that color the best. Twenty-five dollars, October sixteenth, two thousand one. Can you explain to me? Thanks. Uh, I didn't even hear what he said. Can someone repeat what he said? Uh, yeah, you can wear red. And, uh, like I, the most compliments you'll ever get is girls saying you look good in red. That happened to me the other day. And I'm like, Oh, your appearance is huge on her subconscious, like massive dude. Uh, it, uh you could even wear like a military watch and they feel more safe. That's how they are. You could be some work with a military watch. And as long as your whip, your car looks nice, they're not complaining. But um, actually, I think if you're a good looking guy, uh, archetypal imagery is best. So, um, what? Hold on. Enviral bitch donated $5, October 16th, 2001. I'm not doing the math for you. Go off. you got scammed um archetypal like the way if you want to dress like an archetypal so there's an animus and an anima a male and a female perfect um idea of what male and female is although we can't really describe it so let's look at archetypal phenomena okay you have the animus and the anima okay the animus is the perfect male archetypal phenomena that happens in every boy teen adults mind and we adhere to this bad of like to be a male is a bad and it's like it's the divine father it's not your real father but one day you find out your father is just a human and that you adhere to a divine father um and this is how your brain splits it up right and um so me dressing up for a date, I'll wear white shirt, blue jeans, because the archetype of a boy is a white shirt and blue jeans throughout all media, cartoons, all that. 
it works better on the date. It just does for me. It does, and I've noticed that. But now look at this. That animus, the male and the female parts of your brain that, uh, you know, you these can develop and damage your life badly. This stuff dominates red pill. And it's not the male one. It's not the animus that's being dominated. It's the anima that the red pill guys are trying to conquer over. The anima would be Megan Fox, Queen Elizabeth, the queen archetype in cards. Fefgoftal donated $5. Life path 6 second energy is a 7 and Emma Goat is trading the best career for me. You're a thinker, so I don't think that's the best career for maybe i don't know are you doing good at it i don't know i don't know much about seven is the hard one to answer man but what are your deal breakers for a girl in terms of personality usually if they have an only fans deal breaker um if they get bored easy i hate that um girls who don't guard their re reputation so like uh jill's a good example of this like she to get back at me she'll farm clips with dunkel and that like hurts my feelings i guess donated five dollars please finish what you were saying about the anima i will but basically if you farm clips with dunkel it's the whole world laughing at her and me by proxy so they're laughing at me because she's with you know what i mean so it's like it's like she's getting herself five dollars deuteronomy ten eighteen. let there not be found among you anyone who causes their son or daughter to pass through the fire or practices divination or is a soothsayer augur or sorcerer 11 or who casts spells mm. yeah i don't believe numerology is divination at all like how can you predict the future because some because you're an eight how the f is numerology divination Oh, uh, you're an eight, therefore you're either rich or poor. Oh, wow, that's not predicting. All right, predicting stuff is like going in a trance state. Uh, Gary uses numerology to predict the future. No, he doesn't. No, I, I, I swear, Gary, Gary plays good odds. There's no way he's actually predicting the future. <laughs> There's like no way. Uh, that would be crazy. If... Let's go, pal. I'm making a withdrawal here. Geo donated five dollars. Why does Gary wear blue? Is it because of the throat chakra? No. And Gary's not the throat chakra. I am. Gary's chakra would be the third, third eye. Isn't he like the snake mystic? Isn't he like the the wise? I'm the throat chakra. I'm the Zerka's throat goat. Spam it. Zerka's the throat goat. I mean. No donated five dollars. Anima. John, please. Uh, yeah, so anima is like the feminine uh, archetypal kind of phenomena in your brain that you kind of like suppress and then it like grows big, but it's pretty much the feminine traits in you that, that you have to develop, integrate into your life. And if you don't, you don't have that marriage of male and female within the mind. The blood brain barrier of the heart and the brain or left and right side of the brain, some people say, it could be, for me, I think it's heart and mind, really, right? Like heart and mind is crown when they fuse. That's what I think it is. But I don't like to say that's a fact or anything. I'm just saying that's the what, what I believe is the truth. And um, yeah, if you don't develop and integrate your anima correctly, you could be doing theft Donated five dollars, six LP second energy a seven and a goat. What would recommend I do in life? Wait, what's the second energy? There's no two. So what is your secondary? And six LP is uh, tribal responsibility, craving, family, uh, restrictive. Probably not good for business. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know. But I hate saying don't do something because like you have every number wins. If you Google life path guys, like they all win. They are all capable of winning. Dehia donated five dollars. Astronomy and numerology is divination. By the way, you leaked that Gary could predict your death date using numerology. Checkmate, Epstein. Gary is a 
sorcerer numerology is a sorcery yeah. just how astronomy is also idol worshiping i didn't i didn't leak that i said it out loud you and i didn't say i believed it that he can predict someone's death i just said this guy's thinks he can do it um what was i answering uh b before you guys attack numerology you have to ask yourself is you guys on the internet satanic and yes the internet is sorcery the devil is an angel of light electricity your devices are devilish so that guy who sent me that money you're addicted to the internet that's way worse internet is 100 percent sorcery are you f joking me you think it you think it's normal to see that much nudity even if you're avoiding it you can't avoid it on twitter i don't even care if you believe in numerology bro i don't really care i don't sell this shit. second of may 2002 is this bad birthday to have as a male yeah you have three second of May. yeah you have three twos bro you're you have you should not sin bro you should i mean nobody should sin but you should be extra careful I think one two is normal, but like you have two two two, that's you know my research led me to believe two 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 is worse than six six six. I still think six 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 is the worst, and six four nine is horrible, and two 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 is horrific. But like God do the ancients hate two more than other numbers. And yeah, if you want to learn this stuff as like in if you want to learn this stuff don't go to me like i don't i don't slang this shit. i don't sell numerology my shit. so yeah what was i saying i was saying something about 649 is the lottery so these are bad luck numbers or a roulette table if you play roulette adds up to 666 the most restrictive energy even if you buy a business on 666 it'll be cheaper like if you buy it on uh the address adds up yeah notice how the guy attacking me is saying i'm evil notice how he won't say the internet is sorcery notice how he will not say it and i'm not saying it as a reach oh the internet's sorcery it's just a reach it's not even a reach at all it's like all the electricity of sin is in front of your keyboard the internet is the highest level with the computer chips and shit, is the highest level of sorcery, bro. He will not donate or he won't uh, argue with me because now he has to get into the debate of <laughs> noticing a birthday pattern versus the internet and what's more satanic. Because he doesn't want to go live like an Amish guy in the woods with, in a farm. He, he'd rather go to burn in hell. Yes, bro, the internet is the highest level of black magic sorcery, period. If you quit the internet, then attack numerology or anything occult. Which, by the way, uh, I'd say like most of the occult stuff is in the Bible. They just took it out. There's a lot of good stuff you could do with your magic. For example, if you don't believe in, oh, I don't want to do any magic. Are, did you stop doing it? No. 90 Towers donated $5. For the anime guy Noah, black is really a good delegant color that even makes you look taller and yeah. slimmer. Yeah. Even Zerka wears black often. Yeah. True, 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 true. Well, my favorite thing to wear black is that you can pop a symbol harder. So if you have an all black outfit, your Christian bracelet or your necklace will pop. So your symbolism will be like extra charged in everyone's mind so that's why i do it it's like the simplest and the girl stuff i guess too but um hold on what was i saying yeah that's why we pray we repent is because we are at the most satanic age there's ever been right where it's not the deepest darkest sins but everyone is sinning when there was times when it wasn't like this it's because of the digital age it's because the internet that is the biggest, the reason they can even ship a Chrome place to place is because the internet. You are funding a Chrome. Okay, that's not even a reach. Internet is the highest level black magic sorcery and false divination. Uh, anyways, 
because you don't want to, I don't want to learn about magic, John, and I need Magnus, or I don't want to read about any of their work, and it doesn't mean you stop doing it. You're either doing your magic or you're not. When do you stop doing it? Never, not even in your sleep. The internet is crying. donated $5. Yes. What's the top three most satanic things people subconsciously do? Um, lust through the flesh, the eyes. Uh, I'm really good at not doing that. That's why women love me because they can't sense that I want them. So I'm really good at looking at someone without, you know, being uh, all that. But yeah, number one is like I see donated through $5. the eyes. In the eight and have three guys in my close friend group that are 22 LP. What are the implications? Uh, some satanic master builders is what they are. Two, 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 two. There's so many twos around you. Uh, but tw 22 is our master numbers. They go up in life. I'd rather be surrounded by 11s personally. Um, or one good 33. Uh, okay. Okay. Number one is lust through the eyes that you're subconsciously doing. Uh, you're always staring at something you want. Um, number two, it's got to be greed. You don't see your family enough because of your career or for even worse reasons, like you've argued with them. Um, and then, uh, three will be, um, man, I'll say greed again, because no one gives to charity or even helps out, uh, which could be, uh, wrath is rare now. People are such put. I'm not like pedestaling wrath, right? Like wrath becomes good when there's righteous indignation and like a war path for your Bible, but wrath in itself is evil. By the way, if you are those Christians who go turn the other cheek kind of, those kind of Christians get out of my chat, because if you're putting a middle finger up to all the crusades that happen and every piece of Christian history that all those popes and stuff just got it wrong and they should have just turned the other cheeks would have been wiped out by now you you're reading it completely wrong you're reading the text completely wrong let the experts read it another thing guys when you guys are like expecting Zerka to act like Christ you know that's like a saint level like that's higher than saint so when you guys are expecting Zerka well Zerka's got to turn the other cheek and wash my feet and don't the fa Christ is the Father as well. That's why you wash our feet like we're babies. I'm not washing your feet. I wash my son's feet. By the way, Tapia and all these guys who are against astrology, bro, the Bible's filled with astrology. Like, snap out of it. Enough of that. Those people who think there's no astrology in the Bible, are you? What the do you think twelve disciples means? It's a literal story, allegorical story, poetic story, symbolic story, all in one. It's not just a literal story. The Magi, the three Magi. Is there numerology in the Bible? Yeah, obviously the numerology is king in the Bible. What the uh, even the Jehovah's Witness who talk about 144,000 uh, as the final, that what's that equal up to? 4, 4, 8, plus 1, 9, 9 is completion. And I'm tired of people saying 10 is a number, bro. I'm tired of that shit. Let's go, pal. I'm a witch girl. 10 is a number, but not when we're looking at religious texts. How about that? 10 is like the most powerful because the technology of the fives builds the 10, 510. And I'm a five and I'll take it like that. But no, we're not doing it for religious text. No. Easy Zen donated $5. Can you manifest height? I'm your most badass fan BTW. I'm a boxer amateur, pretty skilled. Good looking, but five feet eight inches. I'm more Chad than that one guy you had on your calls. I DM'd you on Twitter at Ezix Zane. I'm wouldn't you do better if you're a five eight boxer? I mean, boxers aren't that you know what I mean. And yeah, I believe you can manifest anything, even height, but it has to be in certain belief cycles. Like, uh, this fraternity I was a part of in 2017, 
that taught us Steiner's work and stuff like that taught us that the reason why humans didn't develop wings and fly is because they didn't believe they could. So they did it in a material plane with metal jets. And I'm like, what? But there was times in history where psychically the community was charging fantasy into reality and they were doing it. And that's what we see in the movies with Avatar and all that. Sh Those aren't abstract ideas. I miss streams like this. This feels normal to me. Yao donated $5. I had a dream yesterday in which I was in a cave with a door that had a sigil on it. Then, a voice asked for a code. I got it wrong. And the voice said, you are not ready. And I woke up. Can you explain? No, I can't because you'd have to explain to me where the f that cave is, who the f sent you there, who, what, where, when, how, the sigil and what it means to you, and you'd have to meditate on it for like a f***ing week to get one grain of truth. Uh, and, you know, sometimes it'll just come to you, though. If it comes to you, then you should bring it back to me. But uh, if you watch a lot of my content, it's probably a religious message that you're not ready for higher truth. Uh, meaning you haven't done the work, meaning you're watching Zerka and not reading the Bible, which is very stupid. But the guys who in my chat who read the Bible as they watch my content, it feels like a movie to them, bro. That's how you should be doing it. What it... Oh, f Stop doing that. I'm the only streamer who don't bot. I hate when you do that, bro. Half GRL donated $5. I always felt existential my entire life. Always had anxiety Same. because of existential crisis. Well, Feel purposeless. Have you felt this? That's exactly my life story, dude. But uh, the anxiety came only when I was failing college and working construction. <sighs> Dehia donated $5. Forgive me, Rabbi Zerka. I didn't mean to trigger you. Liberal. Here we go. He's not going to answer five it. Shekel answer it. Headache. Why don't you the answer the is internet? A magical gateway to sin. Everyone is a sinner. I'm not oh. a perfect man. Oh, now he's not perfect. Now he's God not perfect. Just reading. The oh, do you notice how that snake said, I'm not perfect now? Reality That's like me saying, oh, I'm doing numerology. I'm not perfect, bro. brother. I'd like to hear what that is doing. Now that you are back home, have you rekindled your brotherly bonds with your blood? Yeah, we kick it. We just kicked it recently. We just do movies together and we we kick it. But, uh, you know, he's getting ready for marriage. And so he's doing a lot of planning.